Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Keegan here and welcome back to the channel and I'm back with a brand new video for you guys and welcome to another edition of Keegan's Movie Reviews. And today's movie I'm going to be talking about is one of my all-time favorite movies and that movie we're going to be talking about today, ladies and gentlemen, is True Romance. And True Romance is a crime drama romance comedy film directed by Tony Scott and it was written by Quentin Tarantino. And True Romance was released on September 10th, 1993. And it really feels like that Quentin Tarantino directed the movie, although he didn't actually direct it. However, he wrote it because of the dialogue and he wrote the storyline for it. But this movie was actually directed by Tony Scott, the late brother of Ridley Scott. So, I don't really have too much else to say, so let's dive into the movie itself and then I'll give my thoughts on it. So, the storyline for True Romance, it follows a comic book store clerk named Clarence, who is played by Christian Slater. And Clarence falls in love with a prostitute named Alabama, who is played by Patricia Arquette. And before the two of them could get married, Clarence has to take out Alabama's pimp named who was named Drexel and was played by Gary Oldman, surprisingly. So after, so after Clarence kills uh, Drexel, they run off to Los Angeles. However, while Clarence was at the place where Drexel was holed up, he asked, he demands one of the women at the place he's at, which I think it was probably like a brothel or something. So he demands one of the women there to pack up Alabama's things in a bag. But they mistakenly put Alabama's things in a bag full of drugs. And they don't know that, and little does Clarence know that the drugs actually belong to a Sicilian mobster. And that Alabama's pimp, Drexel, was connected to those mobsters. And, well, you guessed it. The Sicilian mobsters are out there trying to find Clarence and kill him and his wife. And they're basically trying to get away from the mobsters. And that's pretty much the storyline of the movie. Now, when I first watched this movie, I was 16 years old. And I gotta tell you, I loved every minute of it when I first watched this movie. I love the dialogue. I love the characters in it. It's hilarious. And the dialogue is just, it's just badass. It's like... Well, the dialogue is just as badass like you'd see in every other Quentin Tarantino movie. Even though Quentin Tarantino didn't direct this movie, he wrote it, though. Like I said before. I love the acting in it. And the, the scene where Christopher Walken's character and Dennis Hopper's character are having a conversation inside Dennis Hopper's character's trailer that goes on for like 10 minutes is probably the best scene in the whole movie. If you've seen the movie, you know exactly what scene I'm talking about. But uh, I love this movie. And if you've never seen True Romance, definitely check it out. Especially if you're a fan of Quentin Tarantino's movies. You'll love this movie. It's an awesome movie. It's definitely one of my all-time favorite movies. It's definitely in my top ten favorite movies of all time. But uh, I don't really have too many other things to say about this movie. Well, I don't really have anything negative to say about this movie. But... If you, but once again, if you haven't seen True Romance, definitely check it out. It's one of my all-time favorite movies. And I'm going to give True Romance a 9 out of 10. And I know that this review is kind of short, but whatever. So uh, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, please leave a like. Please leave a comment below and subscribe for, for more videos like this. And feel, to follow me on, feel free to follow me on my Instagram. And if you'd like to check out my last review, which was on the Virgin Suicides, which I actually did that review yesterday. The link to that is in the description down below. And my next review will be on The Piano Teacher, which that review will be coming out soon. So in the meantime, thanks again for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. And until next time, this is Keegan Shepard signing off. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.